Welcome guys, I am Harriet, and you are watching EV News on Jexton Electric. In this edition, we gonna be focusing on Tesla news and updates. Click subscribe and the bell icon, so you don't miss out on our next edition. Before we talk about Tesla Model Y update, let's look at the main discussion on AI Day 2022. Tesla covered several key tech topics on AI Day 2022, but Optimus Bot was definitely the center of the show. Tesla showed two prototypes of its humanoid robot on stage, and they were impressive. More exciting, however, are the initial specs of Optimus that were shared during the event. Optimus robot development platform Bumble C was able to walk and dance on stage, without human assistance. But while it's impressive, Bumble C is very expensive, because it's made from off-the-shelf components. A second bot, complete with a Tesla Texas belt buckle, was closer to the humanoid robot's production version which is intended for mass production. Optimus, builds on everything that Tesla has worked on over the years, it's no surprise that Tesla would use its battery technology for its humanoid robots. Optimus comes with a 2.3 kilowatt hour battery, with integrated electronics, which should be sufficient for daily work. In addition, the power consumption is around 100 watts when seated, and around 500 watts when walking at a brisk pace. This power consumption is not really excessive. As CNET points out, Optimus power consumption is very similar to that of high-end gaming PCs. The only difference is that it walks on its two legs, it does all kinds of physical work, and weighs 160 pounds. The brain of Optimus tapped into Tesla's expertise in chip design, so each humanoid robot will have one Tesla system on a chip. As for connectivity, Optimus supports both Wi-Fi and LTE. This should make it easier for Tesla to update and improve the performance of Optimus over time, similar to the company's all-electric vehicles. Optimus is smaller than the company's vehicles, but the humanoid robot actually has a lot of problems due to its design. Tesla says, Optimus has 28 structural actuators that allow its body to bend more than 200 degrees of freedom. Its arm has 11 degrees of freedom, allowing the humanoid robot to move very much like a human. CEO Elon Musk has said Optimus is designed for mass market production, so it will be priced accordingly. The CEO estimates that Optimus will cost less than the company's electric vehicles, around less than $20,000. Let's listen. But Optimus is designed to be an extremely capable robot, but made in, in very high volume, probably ultimately millions of units, um, and it, it, it is expected to cost much less than a car. I'll just bring so, it directly to the right here. Uh, I would say probably less than $20,000 would be my guess. During the event's question and answer session, the Tesla AI team was asked when Optimus will start shipping. After thinking for a while, Musk estimated that the humanoid robot's deliveries could start in around three to five years. After a brief demonstration of the Optimus prototype's capabilities on stage, Tesla played a video of Bumble C working around the Fremont factory. The video shows the robot performing multiple tasks, from delivering packages throughout the factory, to working on the factory floor itself. Demonstrating how the robot can use autopilot technology, Tesla also showed the humanoid robot watering plants at its Fremont factory office. Granted, these are pretty trivial tasks, and the robot wasn't tethered during the demo, but it's a significant improvement over last year, when Tesla had no working Optimus prototype. While much attention during the AI day was on Optimus, Tesla's humanoid robot, the electric carmaker also discussed one of its most ambitious efforts at the event, the full self-driving beta. And Musk estimates that the FSD beta should be ready to expand to more territories by the end of the year. The FSD beta fleet has grown significantly, Tesla revealed at AI Day that approximately 160,000 customers are now participating in the program. That's an impressive number, especially considering that other self-driving companies like Waymo are currently estimated to have less than 1,000 vehicles with self-driving. Elon Musk noted that from a technical perspective, 
FSD beta should be ready for global rollout by the end of the year. However, the CEO noted that in many countries, such a program could require regulatory approval to begin. Such approvals may delay the release of FSD beta in some countries. With this in mind, Tesla owners should probably set their own expectations regarding the performance and capabilities of the FSD beta. After all, as impressive as the system is, in the way it can navigate downtown streets, it still has many areas where it needs improvement. However, with real-world driving data from all over the world, Tesla would likely improve the FSD beta at a much faster rate than before. Tesla Semi with Alien Dreadnought Cybertruck Graffiti appeared at AI Day 2022. Tesla is certainly announcing its intentions with its Tesla Bot Optimus project, as the Cybertruck graffiti on a Tesla Semi parked on the AI Day 2022 venue suggested. During Tesla's Q4 2021 and full-year earnings call, Elon Musk pointed out that Optimus is one of the key products currently under development at Tesla. Musk added that the humanoid robot would be used by Tesla in its factories. With Optimus performing repetitive or dangerous tasks, among other things, this was depicted in Cybertruck graffiti on a Tesla Semi, parked around the venue for AI Day 2022. The colorful mural shows a view of a Cybertruck production line, but instead of the people building the fully electric pickup truck, the vehicle was assembled by Optimus. Several Optimus robots were featured in the Tesla Semi mural, some on the wheels of the Cybertruck and others on the vehicle's bodywork. It's an incredibly futuristic scene, and it could very well be added in the near future. Interestingly, Optimus could become the creator of the difference that will eventually make Elon Musk's Alien Dreadnought factory concept a reality. Thank you very much for watching. If you like this video, please support us by subscribing to help us grow and also be part of our community here at Jexton Electric Channel as we have a mission to take the charge of fighting against climate change by bringing the future of sustainable energy closer to our viewers and subscribers, showing that electric cars are the best cars in the world. For more news and update on EVs, subscribe to this channel. See you on our next EV News Edition.